when we go in the two wheeler we know that helmet is very essential especially when it comes to the rider so i noticed that it is very difficult to open the visor of the helmet in two wheeler when we are traveling when it come for a bike it is very danger to open or close the visor of the helmet so we come up with an idea of making smart helmet where it opens or closes the visor without using our hand so let's start our project without wasting any of wires with the two two way switches where it is used to rotate the motor in clockwise and anti clockwise rotation to identify two way switches it should be having three terminal in its back and next let us do the wire connection take a one wire connect the one wire to the first switch of the first terminal and next end of wire is connected to the last terminal of the second switch Now let us do the second connection take a wire connect the wire to the first terminal of the second switch The other end of the wire is connected to the last terminal of the first switch After this connection now let us give connection to the motor so take a yellow wire connect the yellow wire to the first terminal of the first switch next i'll take a blue wire and connect the blue wire to the first terminal of the second switch After that I will take a helmet now I'll place the two switches to the both the side of the helmet before connecting the switch to the helmet make sure that it should be the exact position of the shoulder stop
and do the same step for the another switch. Now these two connections are given to the gate motor. The middle terminal of the switch is connected to the power supply. Take a black wire, connect the black wire to the middle terminal of the first switch. And other end of the wire is connected to the negative side of the battery. And now do the same step for the other switch. Take a green wire, connect the green wire to the middle terminal of the second switch. And that wire is connected to the positive side of the battery. After giving the power supply, now let us see our helmet is working or not. So when I press the first switch, it is rotating anti-clockwise. When I press other switch, it is rotating clockwise. Hence our smart helmet is working. Here it completes our first step. Now I'll take a trade. Here connect the thread to the one end to the visor and other end to the gate motor. Here I am using hot glue gum to stick the thread to the visor. Now connect the other end of thread to the gate motor. Now I am using super glue to stick the thread and the gate motor. Now because of the thread, now the visor can go up. To come down, let us use rubber band, where because of elasticity, it can come down. So cut the rubber band and place one end to the visor and another end to the helmet side. After connecting the rubber band to the visor, now let us test our helmet. Sorry, smart helmet. So when I press the switch 1, you can see that our visor is going up. So now when I press the switch 2, the visor is coming down. Here we are using shoulder to on and off the switch. So to make easy, let us add ice cream stick to the switch. Here goes our smart helmet is ready to use. Now let us use our smart helmet in outside. Now let us demonstrate our smart helmet. When a rider uses our smart helmet, he can use his shoulder to open the visor and close the visor. In this case, the right shoulder is used to open the visor and left shoulder is used to close the visor. Now let us do the same thing when he is riding the vehicle. We can see that the visor is going up. So this will ensure the safety rate of the rider as well as a passenger.